Hi, I'm Jeff Nelson of VegSource.com. As many of you know, each year we put on an event here in Southern California called the Healthy Lifestyle Expo. Over two and a half days, we bring in top experts in the field of health and nutrition to speak on a variety of topics. We do this as part of our mission to bring the best information possible about how to have a healthy, plant-strong lifestyle. We have these talks professionally videotaped so that people who aren't able to enjoy the event live can share in the experience afterwards on DVD. I think you'll enjoy this brief excerpt from the talk of John Robbins on the Get Healthy Now Red DVD set. The, the, the mainstream thinking around food is primarily taste-driven, convenience and expense driven. I mean, most people, where they sit down to eat or where they think about where they're gonna go out to eat or what they're gonna buy at the restaurant or what they're gonna buy at the supermarket or whatever, those are the taste, cost, and convenience. There's the tripod. And if that's the only legs you're standing on, McDonald's has got you, you know, and Monsanto has got you. Uh, and those companies have managed to externalize the costs to, to, to offload them onto society, onto the environment, onto the future, ge future generations, onto all of our uh, bodies' ex uh, medical problems so that it doesn't show up at price point. So it seems cheap. And it seems tasty because it's full of salt and fat and things that are addictive and processed so that it will be that much more addictive. And so many people then are trapped in those cycles. That's the cultural context. It's, it's toxic. Uh, it's, it's costing us so dearly as a society economically. It's costing us in terms of our, our well-being, in terms of the environment, in terms of our the human-animal bond, there's so many ways that it's, it's violating us and, and betraying us, but so many of us are deeply admired in it. Deeply, deeply, so that if you question that, wait a minute, I think I'll make my food choices and I'll also take into, of course I want to taste good. Certainly I have to watch my budget. Yes, convenience is an issue, but that's not all. What if we also said, what food really makes my spirit fly, gives it wings, fuels my dance, makes my capacity for joy on flower flourish? What kinds of foods help me to thrive, to feel the strongest and cleanest in my mind and cl clearest in my heart and freest in my, in my being? More at peace with myself, more, more honest to, to, the, to the life force inside me. What if we expanded the question so that who we are as people genuinely was involved? Our culture is so into unconscious consumption. It's stunning. I think sometimes that the, the level of denial, it, it takes a lot of energy to be in that much denial. And... Um, I'm getting warm here. We, so we don't think about, so in food, we don't think about where the food comes from. We don't think about the farm workers, what their experience was. We don't think about what is happening. Are they being poisoned by the pesticides that are used in the crops? Uh, are there residues from that that then are entering our body and our bloodstreams and are part of our, become part of our cells? We don't, as a culture, we don't think about that. It's taste, convenience, and, and um, uh, cost. <laughs> Short-term thinking, though. We don't think about the animals that might have been involved. How were they treated? We, we, we're, we're trained not to do that. Think of the extra... McDonald's alone spells, spends more than a billion dollars a year, one company, on uh, mainstream media advertising direct media advertising in this country, a great deal more than that if you count all their other marketing uh, manipulations. And that's just one company. Collectively, the fast food industry spends many, many, many billions of dollars a year to transmit a message. 
and in a very sophisticated way into the minds, into the psyches, particularly of young people, but all of us, do they ever honestly mention the plight of the animals that are involved? Never. Never. They don't want you to think about it. They want to keep the veil in place. And the courage that it takes in a society like that to lift the veil so that you see and then act in terms of what you see. Where does that courage come from? Where do we find it in ourselves? How do we support it in our families? How do we recognize it and, and evoke it in our society? so that we may become a more honest, a more compassionate, a more connected, a more conscious in our, in our eating and all of our consumption patterns. Do we even want to be conscious? Or do we want to choose denial? Sometimes it's painful to be conscious. Sometimes it hurts to care. Sometimes I wish I didn't care so much, but I do. And if I'm going to be honest to myself, I have to be honest to that. I do care. This is just a short excerpt from a presentation on the Get Healthy Now Red DVD set. This DVD set contains a total of 12 fascinating talks on three DVDs, over 13 hours of information in all. The talks include Dr. Matthew Lederman on Navigating Through Health and Medical Misinformation, Learn how to avoid being misled by pharmaceutical studies in order to make decisions based on reality. Dr. Joel Furman gives two talks, Metabolism and Hunger, which shows you how to lose weight easily and permanently, and Longevity and Cancer Prevention, how to protect yourself from the toxic environment. Dr. John McDougall presents a research update, Diet, Multiple Sclerosis, and Autoimmune Diseases, on how to prevent and reverse arthritis, MS, type 1 diabetes, and other autoimmune diseases. And Dr. McDougal gives a second talk called The Starch Solution, documenting how the optimum human diet for thousands of years has been, and today continues to be, based on starchy foods. Jeff Novick presents Healthy Living Made Easy, How to Succeed Without Trying, providing practical tips and information for easily and effortlessly adopting a health-promoting diet. Dr. Caldwell Esselstyn presents Ending the Coronary Disease Epidemic and shares for the first time the impressive results of hundreds of patients in his private practice who have successfully followed his heart disease reversal program over many years. Rip Esselstyn presents Plant Strong, Taking It to the Next Level, sharing the secrets of Plant Strong success that many leaders of industry and sports legends have used as the cornerstone for their robust health. John Robbins presents Antidote to a Mean World, revealing fascinating information about his famous family and uplifting stories of transformation and hope. Reverend Hung Shur presents I Am What I Eat, Meeting Myself at Mealtime, examining historical dietary traditions of different peoples and how culture and media influence the food choices we all make. There's also a lively panel discussion with experts taking questions from the audience, as well as cooking demos from our cooks presenting easy, delicious, and nutritious recipes. Most doctors recommend prescriptions and procedures, which for the most part just mask or delay your inevitable decline from chronic illnesses. The medical experts on Get Healthy Now Red DVD give you practical information and education so you can take charge of your health yourself and actually save yourself from serious diseases. The Red DVD contains 12 talks on three DVDs, over 13 hours of critical health information. If you purchased each talk individually, you could spend $240 to get this life-saving information, but the Get Healthy Now Red DVD is only $89.95, including shipping. This information could save you thousands, perhaps tens of thousands of dollars in medical bills and help ensure you have the best chance of a healthy, happy life throughout your life. Don't let poor health control you. Make sure you have the latest information to get and stay healthy always. Go to VegSource.com and click on Store and buy a copy of Get Healthy Now Red DVD today.